Well, what is going on guys? Luke here today and I wanna talk about a few stocks I bought last week that I think are going to double and maybe even do more than that rather quickly. I mean, seriously guys, it was a great week last week to find stocks on sale and these stocks may still be on discount this week so you need to know what they are. So let's have a little fun and make a little bit of money and all I ask for in return is that you just ever so gently tap that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And the trailer for the private group is at the end of this video and it's epic. So make sure you check it out even if you aren't interested in joining. I mean, it's really cool and maybe I'm biased, I'm sorry. But if you can't even wait for the trailer, the first link in the description will get you there. But enough of all that, let's get into the first stock that I bought. And we've actually talked about this stock on this channel before, but boy, has it ever taken a pounding recently. And that stock would be Nanu Dimensions or ticker symbol NNDM. Hopefully I pronounced that one right, but I'm sure the comment section will let me know how I did. We have discussed this stock before, and in just the past month, it has fallen from its all-time high of around $18, all the way back down to under $10. This company has been strong in every way so far, but they have been taking advantage of huge runs in their stock to continue to do capital raises to pour money back into the business and build up their cash position. Now this is smart management of capital, although it does upset many of you guys out there as it stifles whatever run it's on at the time. Like seriously, they literally raise capital every single time the stock runs up, which is frustrating to many investors. However, it also means that it's followed the same pattern of running up and then falling back and then making new highs again. Now this pullback has been harsher than the prior pullbacks that seen from capital raises, but that has much more to do with the overall market pullback than anything that they've actually done. So you know what that looks like to me, don't you? That's a short-term issue, not an indication of a long-term problem, so I went discount shopping. So the second stock I picked up last week that I think will at least double would be Tattooed Chef or ticker symbol TTCF. So real quick for those of you guys that don't know, they make plant-based foods that are actually quite good. And I do think plant-based foods is the future just like many of us think EVs is the future of cars. And honestly, it went from hard to find at any store to being found easily in most places and the section keeps getting bigger and bigger at the grocery store that they're in. You know, they kind of keep adding things into the store there. Now this is a stock I have been eyeing for some time, but I just flat out missed it this fall and it ran up way out there to almost $30 per share, which honestly was way too rich and the stock just got way ahead of itself. So when I saw it break down under $20 per share, I had to start a position in this stock. And the last stock that we are going to talk about today is one that we have not previously discussed on this channel either. And it's actually an OTC stock, so you cannot buy it on Weeble or Robinhood, but that doesn't make it not a great stock. And that stock would be Very Good Food Company, or ticker symbol VRYYF. Now this stock is down around 40% or so from its all-time high of over $7 per share that it hit in December. And I think in a year, especially with the economy coming back to life, that this stock will flirt with $10 per share again. Now I'm not sure it's gonna actually get there, but I only need it to get the $9 per share to hit the 2x mark, so even if it falls short of that, I'm gonna be very happy. Now I'll give you a word of caution on this stock. This is closer to a speculative play for me, and if the pain continues over the next few weeks as interest rates continue to climb, or at least we think they're continuing to climb, this stock could drop a lot further. Remember in this video up here, we talked about not going all in when you see a deal on a stock. There were big deals that happened last Monday, but if you went all in on Monday, you missed the insane deals on Tuesday. So I started a small position and I'm watching for further dips to build that position out if it happens. I think all these stocks are gonna do very well over the next year, but stick around and check this out as it's epic. Great things in business are never done by one person. They're done by a team of people. Strong teams won't be told what to do. They work together to figure out what to do. In the sharing economy world and the networking world, if you don't give, you don't get. You can't succeed on your own. I see two outcomes. We combine our knowledge and conquer the market, or go it alone and get beaten by Wall Street. Or they can declare bankruptcy, or, 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 or